Hi, this is a quick video on the ZBD 5900GB dishwasher. There's a uh, hinge bracket on both sides of the dishwasher that normally there's normally a rod and a spring here. These things break and uh, you can't buy them anymore. So I've got a quick fix if you're trying to fix your dishwasher. I was going to show you here. So what you can do it's got some little features that break off where these bolts are. If you take a, um, a drill, drill a hole out, thread a bolt in there, then it will allow those bolt heads to catch in these two holes here and here. And uh, you can get your dishwasher functioning again. So what happens, you just stick this in and then push up. And what happens normally, and I'll show you in a minute, the spring force holds this up. And that's why it doesn't just fall out all the time, which is the way it was designed originally, which is another comment I'd like to make. Um, what happens, and I'll show you in a minute, the spring gets compressed after a while and it doesn't provide enough spring force to hold this bracket up and then the whole hinge falls apart inside and you have to pull it out and get a new spring. So here's the part number for the spring you need to fix this. And what you'll see here is this plastic piece is the rod that I was speaking of. And you see that I've got a couple, or actually three springs here. These are spares because I have to replace these more often than not. This looks like an old one. You can see that what its free length is. This may be a new one. Um, I think it is. I bought a spare. So what happens, you see this one's a little bit longer. So when you put that rod in there, it's always compressed a little bit which holds up that other piece so when this thing gets used too much the springs start to shrink in in length or their free length is shorter as they get uh, worked or fatigued so you have to put a new one in otherwise this whole thing falls apart so we're back at the dishwasher now you can see that this just kind of goes in here and then you can see here that the spring is barely long enough to keep this thing into place. If it were longer, it would have upward force on this white bracket, which would hold it into place because there is no other retention for it. So this is the U-spring. So you can see it just barely holds it in place and it will fall out. As it stands right now, this thing's about to fall out. It should be kind of shoved upwards further to hold it in. So I'm going to put the new spring in and push the dishwasher back into place and it will be fine. So here we go. If I can do this one handed, stick the new spring in. You can see now that it's a little bit long and I have to pull down on it to get this into place. So I don't think I can do this one handed. I'm going to have to stick the rod through this hole here. So now everything's in place. The spring's under tension which is pushing upwards on this bracket which keeps those little bolts and bolt heads um, in place. Otherwise, if, if you pull down on this, it'll come backwards and fall out. So anyway, the significance of this video is one, realizing what's going on here, that the spring kind of relaxes over time, so you need to replace these. Two, if this bracket breaks, they're pretty much impossible to find how you can fix it um, to make your dishwasher live on a few more years. Hope this was informative. Thank you.